Hello and welcome to Kerbal Space Program. If you don't know what this game is, just think of it as a NASA simulator. You run this space station, you build rockets, you build satellites, you build space moon rovers and all these crazy things. You can do it really whatever you want with this game, uh, but what I'm doing today is I'm going to attempt to send this satellite into space and orbit the planet so that it can send back information. So I'm throttling up here and I'm going to activate the engines in 3, 2, 1, blast off. Now the main thing that I need to focus on while going straight up is just to make sure that I don't wobble and I have to make sure that I stay facing directly up uh, towards the sky. If I start drifting to the left or drifting to the right, the rocket might get out of control and I might just go face first into the ground. Now this might take a little bit of time before I get to the point where I need to detach the first set of rockets, so I'm going to skip forward there and I'll see you in a moment. Alright, so I've been going up for quite some time now. I'm at 12,000 meters above the planet and I'm starting to wobble. I'm starting to lose control. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, cut the engines, detach, and see if I could get out of here. Oh! Oh my god, that was so close to the rockets. But I'm going up now. Oh, that was close. Alright. So what I need to do next is I need to turn. I need to turn right and see if I can get myself into an orbit. Alright, so now I need to adjust my path and get myself into an orbit. So I'm going to cut the engines and I'm going to go into the map view. And as you can see here, this is my path. This is the path that I'm going to take and I'm going to have to add a maneuver. And I'm going to do it about here and uh, pull this green circle. I don't know what these are called. If you guys know the terminology for it, please let me know in the comments below. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and pull this. That's probably about good enough. Good enough for now. Uh, and then once I get to the other side, I'll adjust it again. So you can see at the bottom of the screen to the right of the circle diagram thing, whatever, um, it tells me that I have to burn my rockets for a minute and 24 seconds. So I'm going to burn my rocket for a minute and 24 seconds here. But you can see at the bottom left of the screen that I'm about to run out of fuel for these four rockets. So I'm going to have to detach them in a second. I'll wait until that runs out. And then detach and wait for them to get out of the way so they don't explode. And then throttle up. And they wound up exploding anyways, but no harm done to the ship. And now that that's done, I have four new full tanks of fuel. I'm going to go ahead and burn for another 45 seconds or so, and then get myself into orbit. All right. So I've been adjusting my orbital path for about 10 minutes now, and in just a moment, I'm going to go full throttle. I want to show you from the map view. Um, when I throttle up, you can see my path gets larger. Cut the engine. And uh, the blue line is now my new path. That's my new orbit, which it's pretty perfect, if you ask me. Well, not perfect, but it's pretty good. All right, so now it's time to set up the satellite. I'm going to go ahead and detach the rockets. Let them float off to wherever they want to float off to. And then I need to extend the four solar panels on the satellite, so let me go ahead and do that. And now for the most risky part of this mission, getting the captain from the cockpit to the living quarters of this satellite slash space station so that he can rend us Vaus with his three crew members. Let's see if I could just ease my way over there and grab on and enter. My god. I thought that was going to be a lot harder. Let's see what it looks like inside. Oh, mission complete! They're so happy. They're so happy. It's making me happy. Mission complete. I completed the mission. <laughs> I made my little spaceman so happy. And it's making me happy. And it's gonna make me cry because there's tears of joy. And my spaceman, they were smiling so much. <laughs> and... And now, and now I'm orbiting the Earth. 
I'm orbiting the Earth, and I'm gathering information and sending it back down to the space station. And my spacemen are so happy. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I got a little bit emotional at the end, but you know, it happens. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. It really helps me out. And let me know what you thought about this video in the comments below.